Hello everybody, Sandy J here. Yeah, I'm just out south of Lawton checking out some old ghost town sites. I think I'm trying to I can't I don't know if I'm pronouncing it. I think this is the site of one called uh Alpheus or something like that. I didn't really I can't really remember what the name was on the map. But yeah, that's back in like in the nineteen early nineteen hundreds. It's like maybe the forties there was a town here. I think this is the remnants of it, These are, this grain elevator or whatever. Because it looks like this is right, right where it would be on the map. There's another ghost town west of here called Emerson. Just as you get a little ways west of the interstate, turning off toward a town called, ghost town called Cookie Town. Yeah, I'm making my way over there. I'm not sure what that is over there. Let me go up the road here a little bit and see what they made. That's an old schoolhouse or something. But I'm going to go over there and check it out. Yeah, I drove up a little bit closer. Yeah, this is definitely an old schoolhouse, probably up to like the early 40s. A Fiatone, yeah, it was a Fiatone. Like I said, there's another town called um, Emerson that's east of here, almost to the interstate. But yeah, there's another old schoolhouse around there. I'm going to kind of drive around slowly and check it out. I'd say it's a Baptist church, and I think it is. Yeah, it looks. it used to be an old, it used to be the Fiatone school. Yeah, I was kind of cruising around the very front of it, I guess you'd call it. Wow, this is cool. I'm pretty sure it's still used as a church. Yeah, it's definitely an old gymnasium. Wow. Talk about the lapidated. This reminds me of an old Head Start school I went to in Frederick where I was a child. Wow, this is far out, man. Dang. Hey, if you like my videos, comment, rate, and subscribe, and check it out. Just keep your comments respectful, you know, but if you really like my videos, you know, just give it a thumbs up. Man, look at all the little vines growing up around here. Definitely not the kind of place that I would like to have a basketball game or something. But yeah. I'm going to go check out Emerson. See you when I get there. Yeah. Me here again, Zanny J. I've just arrived in the what's left of the town of Emerson, Oklahoma. This is the Emer old Emerson Baptist Church. I may have been wrong about the schoolhouse. I think maybe there was one up here somewhere. I don't know. I know there's an old building right there across the highway. I don't know if you can see it or not. Just some old stone structure right there. Yeah. I'm going to go down this road here across the highway and see what's up. I kind of hold the camera on the dashboard. We'll pass through Emerson. What's up? Yeah, there still is a town here, but the houses are like really spread out along this road. Yeah, we are passing Hello Doggies. Aww. Little babies in the road here. Got their little one. Got little baby. Oh. 
a couple of yard, yard dogs out on the road, a few yard dogs, friendly yard dogs, just saying hi. <laughs> Sorry about the brief interruption there. There's another, there's another town up here called Cookie Town. I'm trying not to mess up the camera while I'm driving. There's the church getting left. Yeah, there's another town up here called Cookie Town a few miles south of here. Well, I've arrived in Cookie Town, Oklahoma. It's uh, about, let's see, five miles, six miles south of where I, where I was in Emerson. Yeah, not much here, obviously. Yeah, that sign, little sign there, see it or not, right by those trees. I probably can't see it at the back it says Cookie Town. Then there's another one over just behind me that says Cookie Town. Wow, this is really a trip. Here now, I'm on the east end of Cookie Town. Like I said, it's really not much here. <laughs> yeah, I just want to kind of get it from different vantage points. So there's a town called Temple, Oklahoma that's 11 miles east of where I'm at right now. I'm not going that far. I just wanted to Kind of get different viewpoints. Just want you all to see it. This is Cookie Town right there, so you'll know I'm actually in Cookie Town, Oklahoma. <laughs> well, hey, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you enjoyed a little um, country excursion to some more of the old, forgotten, almost forgotten ghost towns of Oklahoma. Yeah, I've, se I've seen a book, Ghost Towns of Oklahoma, but none of these towns are even mentioned. I'm like, wow, they're actual ghost towns. Like the Fiatone, those gray elevators, you know. You're not looking, we'll see the old schoolhouse, which is Emerson, and you know, there's a church and a few like crumbling structures across the highway there. Yeah, there's a few more around here. In fact, there's a town, used to be a town with railroad tracks, or like on the farm. Well, actually, I think right around. Um, where Pecan Valley is now, there's a town called Tapa, T-A-U-P-A, -A, up to like the 1940s, and then Lawton Group was kind of incorporated, or just kind of like, it became, you know, unincorporated, I should say, and it just died out, like a lot of those little boom towns do. <laughs> yeah, there's one like, there's a, a road out here called Tinny Road, there used to be a town called Tinny. You know, like north of Chattanooga, almost north, there was a town called Nelms. So it's like, wow. <laughs> hey, as always, stay blessed, stay safe, stay healthy, stay at peace, stay real, stay true to yourselves, treat each other the way you want to be treated. In the name of Jesus, you have a good night. Bye.